Howard Bragman, Hollywood public relations giant, dies at 66. He became an expert in crisis PR and also a key advocate for LBGTQ rights during his career. Howard Bragman, a public relations giant who helped guide all-star clients grappling with a dilemma while becoming an expert in crisis PR and a key advocate for LBGTQ rights, has died. He was 66. His death was confirmed to The Hollywood Reporter by a source close to the family. It was also announced by his friend John Duran on Twitter. On Saturday night, my dear old friend for the last 30 years passed away tonight. Rip Howard. Bragman. LBGT warrior. Gentle giant. Wicked humor. Love you eternally. See you on the other. Side. Duran's tweet read. If a Hollywood star found themselves in a predicament, Bragman was. Usually on the call list to help. He most recently repped embattled talk show host Wendy Williams. But over the years his clients had also included Monica Lewinsky and Chaz Bono. Bragman also was known for helping closeted celebrities reveal their sexuality at a time when being outed could destroy a career. Among those whom he assisted in revealing their truth was Meredith Baxter. The Family Ties star who gave an interview after fearing tabloids were about to reveal photos of her and her partner. He was notably called upon to help then University of Missouri defensive player and top NFL draft prospect Michael Sam with his decision to come out publicly ahead of the 2014 draft. Bragman would coordinate the historic announcement with major outlets including the new York Times, ESPN and OutSports. In a statement on behalf of GLAAD, the organization's president and CEO Sarah Kate Ellis celebrated Bragman as an industry leader, who masterfully used the power of the press to create positive change and visibility for LGBTQ people. Throughout his long career, he worked with many LGBTQ 